what's going on folks welcome back to the real legend of gaming and we are here with clash royale folks and this is another episode of everything royale and in today's video we're going to be showing off a new deck that we decided to start using because for one i wanted to learn how to become an expo player and i wanted to see what the hype was about so this deck here we're going to explain to you right now so let's check it out folks All right, so the deck that we're looking at consists of the Rocket, the Mega Minion, the Tornado, the Ice Golem, the Expo, the Skeletons, the Log, and the Ice Wizard. And we're going to be using this deck in some challenge matches and some ladder matches. All right, so let's check it out, folks. But I want to get better, right? This is the only way to get better is by practicing. What kind of decks you used to play um, when you were playing Clash Royale, Texafar? All right, we'll drop Mega Minion in the back. And we'll bring in the Ice Wizard, too. And let's log so we can hit those Fire Spirits. And let me drop my Expo. Bring in the Ice Golem. Bring these Skeletons over here to distract. They did a good job by dropping that Ice Golem there. All right, cool. Come on, refocus. There we go. There we go. We're looking good right now. Fire Spirits will do some work. That's fine. All right, cool. So now we're going to play our Ice Wizard. Oh, so you... Um, Okay, so you play light decks, 2.9. Elixir, that's pretty cool. So you like to play like cycle decks too. All right. Yeah, I usually play kind of heavy, man. Maybe like uh, mid threes, like, you know, like control decks and stuff. All right, so they're dropping down. Now that they know I haven't playing Expo, they're going to keep dropping all these spawning troops in front. Which is fine because you know what? Our ice golem is going to headbutt that tower. And it's only within like a rocket and a log away. So we can start working on the other side. We'll drop down our ice golem now. And let's log whatever we could over here. Let's drop the expo here. We'll drop the skeletons. And I'm going to. Tornado everything over. Drop the ice golem on the other side to start tanking. We're now chipping away at the goblin hut. Let me use the log on those fire spirits and goblins. So we got one hut down. We got the furnace down. So again, we use it defensively. And now we just start defending right before they start stacking up all these annoying spawner cards. Here we go. We're going to use the Expo defensively. Because again, I, I can just start working on the other side with a log and a rocket. And still defend on the left hand side with everything I can. While the Expo starts ripping up all the buildings. So here we go. Now we're going to start working on that right hand side with chip damage. There goes one rocket. And here goes the log. Game over. Hopefully. Yeah, no. See, I forgot we're playing on um, challenge, so the log is dumbed down a little. But that's fine. We're still defending, right? We're still defending. And this is game over right here. So, good stuff. Good game. Thanks for sharing the broadcast, bro. So, you're using Lumberjack, Log, Ice Golem, Mega Minion, and a few other cards. That sounds like a pretty good deck. Now watching, if you have a deck you want me to try out during the stream, just let me know. I'm, I'm totally cool with that. I will, um, I'm not playing any ladder matches, so I can use any deck. I will drop the Expo. We want to play defensively against this P.E.K.K.A. Alright, so cool. So now we know they have a rocket, we can start baiting it out. 
All right, so we got rid of that P.E.K.K.A. We're going to drop down our Ice Golem over here. We know that they don't have a Rocket Cycle yet, so we can spam these troops without worrying. See, now that's a problem right there. All right, so we did enough damage to them to let the Archer Tower chip away. Sweet. So we built a, a positive trade right there. Let's just let our count build up. We should be able to push with no problem. All right, said that too soon. So this is going to be a problem with Giant Skeleton. So let's try to cycle to our Ice Golem quick enough. Let me log that Princess back. All right, good. So we got the giant skeleton to go to the middle. So we should be fine. Now I'm going to drop the ice golem. And then shortly after that, we'll drop the expo. They might throw the rocket. There's a chance that we're going to take. Instead, they play the P.E.K.K.A. So let's drop down our one Alexa Skellies. P.E.K.K.A. is going to stay stuck for a second. We'll play our Mega Minion. Ooh, I wanted to play Tornado right there too, and I didn't. All right, it's all good, all good. All right, we'll drop Ice Wizard. So that Infernal Dragon will not get any damage on our tower. All right, so we're looking good with defending, but we're going to have to grind this match out because those Pekkas is going to be a pain. All right. So it looks like they're going to start chipping away with the rocket since they threw the rocket we know that we can use our expo and we can also stack up they dropped down a poison so i'm not going to throw down my one elixir skelly let's pull all this away to give us a little more of advantage and now the expo is locked into the tower and we're attacking the ice wizard at the same time there goes the pekka let's try to kite it away if we could All right, we got the ice golem on the other side. Now let's tornado everything over. There we go. And we got, oh, bang, rocket time. We're getting something. Boom, shakalaka. We use the mega mini now to kill this giant skeleton. That explosion is going to do a lot of damage, though. I do acknowledge that. Let's throw down our expo. Hopefully, it can get this win quick enough. Let's throw down the Skelly so that the Infernal Dragon can focus on them next. Let's tornado all this over. Expo still locked on. Come on, come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Let's go, game over. Bang. That's what I'm talking about. I think we're starting to get the hang of this. What's going on, folks? See a lot of people joining, loving it. Thank you for all the support, folks. All right, we're going to throw this Ice Golem behind the King's Tower. And we're going to let him roam. And we'll follow up with the Mega Minion. So now that we see that we have a Giant, just got to be a little bit careful. Let's try to tornado all this. Gives the Mega Minion a chance to catch up. And then we're going to use the Ice Wizard to slow things down. I'll bring in the Skeletons to start chipping away. And then let me distract the Night Witch with this Ice Golem. It didn't work out the way I wanted, but it's all good. We stopped it. Mega Minion is going to protect against that graveyard. And I'm going to drop down this Expo as soon as uh, everything's clear. So there we go. Now we're going to start doing some chip damage. They play the Inferno Tower. It's all good because we're still going to get damage done. And the Mega Minion is going to sneak in there slowly. So we got that. All right, so now we can play it smooth. We'll let the list account built up. And then now we drop down Ice Wizard again. And you know what? Let me put the Skellies in there. Just in case the Inferno Tower was still active. We could distract them a little bit. Buy us a little more time. All right. Let me uh, tornado all this closer. And drop this rocket on top of that Witch and Giant Skelly. And then we're going to try to kite it away with this Ice Golem. There we go. Now Ice Wizard is gone. Now we'll drop down the Expo. 
And then we throw down the skellies. This just gives us a little more time for protection. There goes the graveyard. We'll throw down the mega minion. Interesting usage of the graveyard and freeze. I mean, they wasted nine elixir right there to not even take out my uh, expo. And now they're using another five elixir to take it out, and they're not able to. So definitely um, bad choice of defensive counters, right? Because that just didn't work. Now let's tornado all this over. And then we're going to rocket. Uh, nah, I'm going to miss the rocket. For some reason, I thought it was going to pull to the right. So that was pretty bad. But we did stop everything. And let's pull this giant back. And let me drop this ice golem here. We'll log the rest back. And uh, even with that, <laughs> that Chief Pat Tornado, right? We we're still going to win the match. We're going to drop the Expo here. We'll throw down the Mega Minion and we got the victory. It wasn't really a clean one, but we got it.